Hey, what's up, guys? So I'm doing a re-upload of the last video that I did. Um, basically, last tutorial, uh, the audio was kind of off, and the video wasn't actually recording what I was doing. So I figured, you know, why not go ahead and do it over? So I'm gonna just try to make this as quick and brief as possible. I do apologize about the last video. Anyhow, once you add your source, your webcam will appear here. It should show up like this, you know, with the little um, squares that you can move around. Let me unlock that so I can mess around with it. It'll probably appear like this, maybe a little, you know, wider or taller. But when you right click on it, you can transform it and you can move it around by, you know, stretching it to the screen, which looks like that. Ignore all that, you know, my fridge and stuff, kunai knives, whatever. Fit it to the screen. What I did was I went into filters and I changed the aspect ratio, I guess you can say, to be by cubic. So it gave me these options. I didn't mess around with none of these. I did read over it, but I just went with by cubic. It seemed like the easiest way for me. You can mess around with that. Anyways, I went with the four by three. So it's four by three. 16 by 10 is different depending on what you're doing it might be you know more specific to what you want I don't mess around with these right here just because I feel that it's fine the way that it is I went ahead and did 4 by 3 so once you're done you can uh, scale it down you know to fit your needs for me uh, I already have my frame ready I'm gonna just set it down right here and make it a little bit taller. Not that tall, obviously. Yeah, that should be all right. So right now in this bar, you can see that my webcam frame is on top of the uh, the web actual webcam, which is why it looks neat. You know, the screen's not on top of it; it has a little border. So yeah, when I do Fortnite, I like to keep it here. You can still see the logos. When I do Borderlands, I'll go ahead and move this up here. You can still see the mixer part. It doesn't look too bad. That's basically it for this video. Hopefully, it gives you a better understanding. I believe maybe once. I'm not sure how I did it, but I don't think you can do it anymore. You were able to actually, you know, mess around with it and actually free scale it I guess you can call it to where you can like make it really thin tall and such you know if you go up this wouldn't move if you go wide the other side wouldn't move it just be perfect basically but this is the best that you can do for now but yeah hopefully this video helped you out if it did don't forget to give it a like don't forget to subscribe and uh, yeah I have other uh, social media that you can go ahead and follow so yeah see you on the next one thanks for watching